Is this like a one-man band type deal? I, I guess so. <laughs> I, I would compare it to something like uh, Dashboard Confessional in the early days there. That was kind of the idea. It was a, it was a high school thing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah well, well, so what, what got you into making, to doing this kind of one-man band type deal, to putting your music out there? I, I just, uh, it's kind of a good outlet, I guess. Um, I always find that there's kind of songs that I've just got kind of inside of me that, that need to come out, get, get bottled up, and <laughs> people need to hear them. And so you have, you've, 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 I've heard one of your songs, the, the Roses. Can you tell us about that song and the making of that one? Uh, it, it's a pretty recent one, I think, and it was start to finish kind of written and recorded in the last uh, three, four weeks or something like that. And um, I just wrote, wanted to write a song about uh, maybe like kind of living in the moment sort of thing mm-hmm. to... Hopefully that doesn't sound too yeah. cliche, but no, yeah, that's essentially what? what it is, you know. All music is kind of cliche. Like yeah. you, you take the best songs ever, you read it as a poem. It sounds kind of cl- it sounds kind of corny. I'm, I'm in a <laughs> bracket with all of those other songs about roses now, you know. Yeah, <laughs> it, that's it, it, it's, it's, it's whatever, man. It's not a big deal. Uh, so I hear a couple of guitars in there. I hear drums. Is that all you? You do all that yourself, or do you have some buddies that come over and? It's it's all me except for the drums. That's a that's a loop. I'm uh, I can't like chew gum and walk at the same time. So <laughs> drumming is a little tough. <laughs> well, we're gonna hear that song after the forecast. Stick around. Your song is called "The Roses." I thought I'd quiz you on songs with a rose connection. How does that sound? I think I'm ready. Yeah. Well. Okay. So it could be. So the connection could be the title, or it could even just be the artist's name. Okay. All right. So you ready? Are you ready for your first clip here? I think so. Yeah. All right. Here we go. That one's easy, eh? Oh, piece of cake. That's Guns N' Roses. That's Guns N' Roses. That's Axl Rose. That's Sweet Child of Mine. That is perfect. Yeah, per- I, I I could have given more detail, <laughs> but I, I went with a simple answer as to not screw it up. Yeah. Well, you, you're one for one. Try this one out. Only grows when it's on the vine. Handful of thorns and you know you... What's the connection there? Oh, you, no. <laughs> I skipped the opening line to the song. That would be the the. Hit. <laughs> oh, you know what? I'm gonna have to take the buzzer on this one. Oh, man. Oh this man, that is love is a rose. <sighs> so disheartening. Yeah, you know what? That's okay. You can you can, maybe 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 the next one's the hardest one. So it's kind of cheating here. We'll, we'll try this one out. Just like every night has its dawn. Now he's making a face like he knows the answer. <laughs> yeah, every rose has its thorn. There we go. A little big po- old little poison. <laughs> well, good job. Two out of three. That's a passing I was, grade. I was thinking for sure that <laughs> Seal's Kiss from a Rose was going to pop up in there. I was ready for that I, one. You know what? I had it in my brain. I thought that one might be a little bit too easy, so I'd, I'd test you a little bit. We'll be right back with Nathan after Felix Cartel. Well, Nathan, we're about to play your song, The Roses. Can you tell our audience what they're going to hear in this song, what this song means to you? Um, it's, I guess... It's kind of tough to describe, I guess. You know, you kind of struggle to describe your own music. You hope to let it speak for itself, but uh, lots of acoustic guitar. It's maybe a little heavier than what I would normally make, so I guess um, t- take that for what it's worth. But uh-huh. yeah, it's uh, just kind of a reflection on a certain point in my life, and not just that, but kind of the people around me too. Like yep. to. Uh, if I just wrote about myself, that'd be pretty boring. So I like to drag other people into the mix. <laughs> <laughs> it works for a lot of people talking about themselves. But, uh, uh, well, Nathan, how can we uh, keep tabs on you? How can we know what's going on next with Rainy Day Apparel? Um, I've got a show coming up on the 19th in Morden with a band called Hillsburn. I'm super excited. They're, they're a really cool band. Um, and then if anyone wants to look me up on Facebook or Twitter or Instagram, pretty easy to find. And, uh, SoundCloud is a good place to find my music too. So, well, we hope to hear from you soon. Thank you for joining us. Nathan. Thank you so much for having me. And here's his tune. The Rose is right here on the Eagle 93.5.